So welcome to the, oh, this is a little sad, the last episode of the semester. Um, we're having a small issue because Jamie broke her mic a little bit. I didn't break my mic. I'm okay. I'm she fine. messed up the button, but oh well. Um, we have a really exciting and fun, I guess, episode for you guys today. Because I'm not sure if any of you have seen it or heard about it or whatever you want to say about it. Um, there's basically this thing that's been going around for a while called the best friend tag. Where you ask your best friend a bunch of questions, and then whoever gets the most questions wrong has to do something, like do something stupid, say an embarrassing story, buy something for the other friend, etc., etc. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're going to be doing today for the second segment, but for the first segment, I don't know what we're doing today. <laughs> it's really depressing since it's our last episode, and I feel like because it's the last one, we didn't want to think about it, so we didn't really plan anything else. Mm -hmm. Other than, like, the questions, so. Yeah, so for our first segment, we don't have anything. We're not going to talk about news because, honestly, I haven't been keeping up with the news since, like, Friday. <laughs> um, so we're going to just talk it out. I feel like there hasn't been much with the news. No. Jamie and I were talking about... Jamie and I got here a little early today, so we were talking about, you know, like, the normal girl things, whether or not one of us would get arrested, if I would give her a kidney. yeah. Um, she's going to be my alibi if I commit a crime. I'm going to yeah. be her alibi, but if we both commit the crime, we have to get a third party involved to be our alibi. Except we don't have any other friends, so we're kind of screwed yeah. if we both commit the crime. Uh, we have we to take turns. Uh-huh. So what else did we talk about? I think the funniest thing was the thing with the kidneys, because Jamie has this thing for salt. Yeah. And I, w I was saying that I couldn't wait until our generation were like was like <laughs> older people, so like our generation was kind of like... Able to take over and yeah, like old people do now. What we want are, you because know. she was talking about I already forgot who it was, but she was talking about this guy that's running for president, and Huckabee. she basically oh I just the name antagonizes Your me. Your name is stupid, Huckabee. I'm sorry. And she was talking about how much she hates everything he stands for, and how she wishes that our generation were was the generation able to make these decisions and do these things for the future mm -hmm. since it's our future. Because our generation is more open-minded. So or at we, least you would hope. Yeah. Well, some. The majority. The majority of our generation is more open-minded than the generation now. Yeah. So I feel like if our generation was able to make these decisions, the world would be better. Yeah, I agree with you. In a sense, yeah. Um, then you always get those idiots who just screw it up for everybody, but they say one stupid thing and but yeah. you wonder and what's then, wrong with them. And then she told me that I didn't wasn't gonna be there because I put too much salt in my things, and then I said you she can was, give me your kidney. No, you don't understand, Jamie. I, we always we got fries today because we wanted a little snack before the show, and we put salt on them like we always do, and then she started to individually put salt on each fry that she was about to eat. Um, it's a thing. It's not a thing. It's a thing for me. It's not a normal thing. Thanks. I love you, but no. gotta work on that. And then she said I wouldn't have a kidney anymore, so then I said I could have one of yours, and she was like, No. Nah. No. Nah. Can't. Sorry. <laughs> that can happen. Because. Because <laughs> reasons. Reasons. That we can't say on, on radio because I feel like we're gonna. Can that be our new excuse for everything? Because reasons. Because reasons, yeah. Just like our insult is, you're a savage. <sighs> Our new excuse is because of reasons. I feel like because of reasons and we're in a recession, you can just say them for yeah. anything. And they're you're a savage. We talked about this last time, so I feel like we shouldn't talk about it that much today. I don't know how long we've been on air right now because I forgot to time it, but like, I don't know if we should take a break or not. So two I'm just, minutes. Like, thinking out loud. We have been talking for two minutes, and Jamie really wants to take a break. You oh, see this? I didn't know how long it's it was. It's our last episode, and she's tired of us so fast. Sorry. You should be. Timers. Stopwatch. Jamie put up a picture of her sister today on Instagram, and I was so happy when I saw it. She's my woman crush Wednesday because she's the coolest. She is the most adorable, most beautiful creature in the world. Thank you. Aww. Even though she uses Jamie's makeup when she's not there. She, yeah, she thinks that my beauty blender is an egg, so she <laughs> takes it out of its little box thingy, and she, like starts rubbing her face with it in front of my mirror and making all these like funny faces apparently that's what you look like when you do your makeup apparently that's what I look. and then she like takes my lip um products and puts them on her face and says that she's pretty and she like puckers her lip and she's like <laughs> yeah. true story <laughs> she's so cute though like ugh. anything she does i feel like you have to go along with it mm -hmm. just because of like the little face she gives they're you so entertaining babies like they're just 
they don't know what's going on, so they don't even know how funny they are when they're doing these things. And you laugh, and they're, like, so confused as to why you're laughing. (laughs) It's so funny, though, because Jamie and I are, like, obsessed with babies. And at the same time, we don't want kids. No. Because we don't like babies. So it's a little... It's very contradictory, but... Yeah. yeah. (laughs) None of it it really makes sense. in our minds. Because, like, I don't know. I like the babies that are related to me. Mm Mm-hmm. Like, my nephews and my cousins and stuff like that, and, like, your sister. But other kids, like, I can't handle them. I know. I, I don't like other kids. If I'm around them for more than, like, 20 minutes, I'm like, ugh. They annoy me, actually. Yeah. And anything their parents do, I'm like, you're so annoying. My mom, you want to hear something crazy? My mom got a new dog over the weekend, and she literally came home, and there was just a dog in her room, like, that's it. Like, I walked into her bedroom, and I was like, this is great, ma. He's so cute. He's, like, he's wrinkly adorable. and chubby and tiny, and he can't bark. He, he, thinks he's he like, also can't walk. <laughs> he thinks he's, like, the coolest, toughest thing around, and he's yeah. cute. He's, what is he? He's an English bulldog, I think. Yeah, he's an English bulldog. So he's basically going to end up being, like, 60 pounds of wrinkles and anger. I want to squeeze him. He's so squishy. And cuddle him. He's so but he, cute. He's, like, teething, so he's still biting everything. and uh. He's so tiny. <laughs> Sophie, like, smacks him around a little bit. Uh-huh. But I think I am about two pets away from legally being able to charge people when they come into my house. So I got that going for me. Mm-hmm. Get two more and you can do Oh, my God. That's... Yeah, like, if I get some kind of lizard and maybe, like, a hamster, like, I'm just going to start charging people. Just get two fish. That's easier. I already have a lot of fish, though. Oh. My mom's new thing is that she wants to save, like, all the animals of the world. So every time we go to, like, Petco and she sees a cat, she starts freaking out and crying and talking about how much she wants to take it home. Aww. So I feel like if we get anything else, the next thing we get is going to be a cat. But Costa's going to have some company. Costa doesn't want company. He He's... just wants to sit on his brown chair. He's royalty. He can't, like, yeah. have anybody else. My dad spent, like, I don't even remember how much money on this, like, gigantic recliner and my cat is the only person allowed to sit on it because whenever someone else does he freaks out like he'll sit on the floor and scream and like screech until you get up i should sit on and see what he does he freaks out or he'll just sit there and give you this like death stare that makes you think he's gonna murder you when you sleep one night but you know oh my god he tries to be tough but he's like 18 pounds of love he's so cute and aggression He's shiny. Jamie's in love with him. I love him. I'm obsessed with that cat. He's so cute. He's like there. He's just so pudgy. You can't help it. You just want to like pick him up. And his name is Cosa. Like what? Ca- like that's that's. Just his name so is cute. Oswald Amadeus Cosa Fitzgerald. I know. He's but classy. He's a gentleman. That's long for Cosa. Yeah, basically. The thing. The thing. The thing. The thing. Cosa. The thing. Creature of the night. <laughs> creepy. Okay. I am so tired. Like, I really want to do the show, and I'm really excited for, like, the second segment more than anything. It's just, I feel like all of my energy is not with me today. I'm sorry. And I'm, I'm so, like, I'm, like, the opposite. I'm Really? I'm You're not like... tired today for once. Now, I know I'm always tired, and I always have a headache at this time, like, on Wednesdays, mm-hmm. and I'm falling asleep. And, like, I'm yawning as I'm looking at you talking. But today, I feel really energetic. I, like, energetic. I can, like, feel my eyes, like, slowly closing. Like, if I blink too slowly, I'm gonna fall asleep. I started yawning. <laughs> just talking it's about contagious. it. contagious. Oh, damn it. Uh, okay. I think Jamie needs a nap. So we're going so to take, take a short break. And, yeah. When we get back, we're going to go into our second segment and announce our... I was going to say announce our topic for next week, but that's not a thing. And oh I guess we're going to announce our third segment. And then we're going to talk about our plans for the summer and tell you what we're going to do. Summer's going to be really fun. Mm-hmm. We're going to have a show next semester, so that's going to be fun. Great. So. 